Hello and welcome back dear friends, it's me Odo and we are back in our EU4 campaign with Ethiopia um, Last time we got rid of a few of the smaller countries still left in this region and today we will uh, hopefully get rid of the last one of these of a Juran um, Yeah, let's do this I will take some breakfast at the time. Hmm. So probably you can't hear me because I'm just eating. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bigger Mayo? Where is Bigger Mayo? Ah, that's down there. It's um vicinity of Sanzibar. Mm -hmm. mm. We now control most of the East African coast, at least down here to Ipo. And next we will attack Mutapa to get the coast down to Angosh and to get our uh, foothold there because there are some really really rich country sites like um, uh, gold mines and the stuff mm. and also ivory and slaves and stuff like that mm. Oh yeah, we have a free uh, free diplomat. This one we will send to the Mamluks again, but uh, he has to wait until November. Let's take care more. Over. Mm, whatever. We will take ev everything anyway. Do you have the good general? Take this general. Um, if we take this countries, then and we also should get, I believe, the unified culture. I believe we have done Cushitic everywhere. Or, or we have every Cushitic province. Hopefully. I mean, I, I don't know if these um, um, unsettled lands where only the natives live also count as Cushitic. Uh, um, where do we see this? The, uh, it says political, economic, geographical, no, geographical, I believe. Areas, regions, states and territories, overseas provinces, probably not geographic, geographical. Diplomatic, hmm. coalition, federation, trade league, rivals, player, nah. Technology, institution spread, devastation, culture, yeah. I mean, this is part of the culture group, but it's not... But it's not settled, so I hope we don't need it because these are the last lands that are not mine 
and we don't have any um, any settlers, any colonists to settle this. No. Yeah, I'm pretty sure because Beja, I mean, we have now even Egyptian in our in our lands. We should um, we should think of getting some other. Ah, we have Nubian. Okay, we could take Swahili because we want to get down there. Ah, oh, but we have al already every Swahili in our country, so probably Shona or something. Uh, but we need diplomatic points for that. don't want to expand there yeah, yeah let's fetch the other ones Do you So, the heretics of Barava are now good, faithful, Coptic tri Christians. Christians. So, we don't need the uh, edict here anymore. That's good. So, you are going down there where we have still in on probably where where do we do it now in Tanga we are we have to so in Malindi or Mombasa how about Malindi how about Mombasa it will cost us 4.5 ducats per month and it will cost us 30 months really and have a debt 4.6 and 28 months I mean they are crazy <laughs> they are crazy <laughs> but how much um, unit do we get with Mombasa and Ma Mombasa we will get 2.2 that's quite good and with Malindi only 1.8 so we'll take Mombasa is really costing us quite a bit of money. <laughs> you let to here. And we have some rebels uprising here. Uh, where's that in Aswan Corsia? So in the newly newly achieved provinces, so let's let's raise autonomy there and also here because it's <laughs> it's a devastation of ninety two percent. We will uh, we will need some some. Uh, damage control up there anyway somehow some sometime oh let's let's move there and 
go there. That's okay. How about this? Uh, already at 14%. And we have the Siege of Gedo. You go to this guys. You will take these and then our war is over. And our next war with Mutapa will come. This was fast and furious. Ha 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 ha. Oh, we are so funny. <laughs> Let's go here. Do we build there the castle now? No, we don't build it. Why didn't we build it? We wanted to build a castle here. Yeah, anyway. It will soon be gone, hopefully. Mm, not really too soon, but it will be gone, the devastation. Like, go there, and you come here. What do we do there? Ah, we built the castle here. Oh, that's that's nice. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, we really are not interested in Kismayo paint and this kind of thing anyway. Mombasa, that's fine, but not these. So. Let's sue for peace. Let's take everything. Let's take your money. Uh, let's ignore the Mamluks because they are really not interesting to me. And yeah, that's it, more or less. So let's see. Probably we'll need to wait a month. Aswan, Kisir are now part of our country. That's okay. Even stupider to have built it here and not there. On the other hand, we also um, are taking care of Mogadishu with this castle and Mogadishu is a really important and rather rich um, province. This is a Jurem province. This is a province we really don't care. So that's okay. Let's raise autonomy. Yeah, this province we matters. Alcoy. Because it's part of a state already. And the state was doing progress here. Or prosperity.
So I'm gonna do a call there. Because this is uh, causing some issues down here. I mean, normally they should be. Oh, come on. Why aren't you prosperous? Why aren't you prosperous? I mean, uh, we have even a castle there. I mean, I understand that you are not prosperous because of Halaib, but. Uh, and Halaib will never be <coughs> prosperous, probably. Uh, we'll have to tackle this one. Probably we'll build a castle here if we have the money left. At the time we uh, even have less money. So let's do some trade stuff. Kilva. Nah, Kilva is the wrong trading site. Uh, let's look at. Let's look at this. So, uh, we have here the Zanzibar node, and we have now really nice places of the Zanzibar node. I mean, we are up to this point. Go away. And this and that is also Zanzibar node. So, if we collect from the Zanzibar node now, as we have a another level 2 coastal center of trade. We have now two centers of trade and uh, two natural harbors. And we will do war with um, with and we'll try to get these two. If we take Angosh, uh, we can probably also take these two. No, we can't because it's not Mutapa. But we can take Sofala. Yeah, at least we can take Sofala. So if we take Angosh, Sofala, and what's that? Some Bezi estuary local trade power plus the and and um, if you if we take these three provinces, uh, we will even have more Zimba, um, Zanzibar trade. Yeah, that's quite good. Let's move down there. Ah uh, no, let's move up there and tackle these two thousand troops. Or oh, you go down there. Yeah. Let's do it like that. Uh, and as I said, let's let's do the killer trade. How about Ang where is Angot and Damot? No, Darfur is not in Damot and Angot. Where are they? They're probably up here somewhere, aren't they? Where is the mod? It's here. Ah, it's in the Ethiopia node. And Angot. That's here. This is also Ethiopia node, probably. No, this is the Aiden node. So Angot is quite okay. Yeah, let's 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 the marketplace in Angot first before we go to Kilva. On you, man. No. <laughs> ah, 
Ah. Ah, I see. We can't build a spy network there because it's part of the uh, of the Mamluk. So we'll have to probably um, our vessel is not intelligent enough to know that he has to uh, make a spy network in the with the Mamluks. So we'll, but we'll do a spy network on the Mamluks anyway. So it's okay. No, that's not the Mamluks, that's Hormuz. So we are stupid. <laughs> How about Katiri? Is this already Yemenite? No, but they are working on that. Let's get into position and afterwards we'll... Uh, what's that? Empire of China. I never saw this before because I uh, the, the Mandate of Heaven is a rather new um, DLC. I never looked at. And, and I really don't know why, why do we have 55 points here? The Emperor of China may take the following additional diplomatic actions. Being the Emperor of China gives the following benefits. Okay, so uh, we have 55 mandate points. Mm. But I really, I, I really don't know. Only the Emperor can enact decrees. Can I do anything here? I mean, or, or do I just see it? These are the tributaries of Ming. That's probably uh, uh, like the like the Holy Roman Empire stuff. I mean, we can't do anything there as well. Anyway, we have a minus 0.16. Ah, no, that's not my force that I have, that's the, that's the power of the Emperor at the time. So it's just there to see for me how they are doing, I mean they are doing probably better than the uh, Holy Roman Empire because they only have two reforms done and they really have a problem because uh, because they have so many heretics hmm. it's better to be Coptic because we don't have heretics we just have heathens <laughs> okay Also, I really wanted to know um, how fast we are doing in this concern. Yeah, still, we don't have the unified culture. So also, these lands that are green now here should be in our country, but we can't take them because we don't have any colonists. This is stupid. This is not possible for us. <laughs> uh, okay. Fully embrace either the humanism or religious idea group. Yeah, well, we'll we'll do probably religious next time. But um, yeah. I, after we did the uh, we do this uh this. The Age of Reformation is over, probably. Most probably. <laughs> but now we have 665 points. How much splendor do we need to... Uh, 800, okay. And we have two of these. 
the institution spread and the religious wars. Yeah, the religious wars is probably r rather nice for me. Because there are no other Coptic nations anymore, so every war is a religious war. So we won against these guys. Let's move down. Let's get some oh, minus four point eight. Why is that? We really have to think about getting some money. <laughs> Let's mothball all the force because uh, whatever we are doing, it will cost us probably. I mean, these force are not really important at the time. This one, even so. So there are no fours that can help us suppress devastation. No, that's done. Here we have four built, but it's not active. Also at this point. So at this point, so yeah, sure, why not? Let's see if this helps. I mean, Mutapa is at war at the time, so it's uh, even less able to do something about us. We'll probably will turn on these two fours after we declared war with Mutapa. Mm -hmm. How about the unrest? Uh, there it's quite high. But we have to uh, two legions down there and you will get the last of the two leaders of the three leaders will go up there to quell the rebellions up there or do you stay here I mean these are rebellious regions as well And we said we wanted to do something about this and that. Uh, but both we have to integrate first. And also this one. But this will be integrated fast. And it doesn't have any devastation anymore because of the... Uh, because of the here. Mm -hmm. We have to do something about our life. This is holding back the whole province. Yeah, that's that for today, and I hope you join me tomorrow. Uh, until then, uh, we'll see each other. Have a nice evening. Bye.